Good morning, guys. This is Alan here, and this is going to be episode two of trading with Top Step. So on our last episode, we had a nice little gain of uh, $1,100, and I'm currently looking for a potential trade um, either for these lows down here, ideally for these lows down here, or a run on the, a buy side, a nicer run to take out these highs. So right now I'm observing to see if it wants to run these lows. Uh, in my opinion, uh, I think it should be running highs, but we will wait and see. I think this is gonna be a small entry. Two lots of it. I mean, it's two contracts right here. And then uh, I'm looking to see if they respect this candle. Ideally, I want to see them respect this candle. So I'll put my stops right there. Oh, it looks like they want to come to this low. And then I'll put my TP for these highs here. Oh. I want to see if they do run for these, uh, run for this high. The entry was a little bit early, to be fair, but it's all right. Could have been better, in my opinion. Um, But yeah, I want to see it start running higher now. I should take out these highs here would be ideal. But we will see. We will see. Okay. Let me see, keep going higher, keep, keep going higher. Mm. Yeah, I do not want to see this lower taken now. Yeah, I see it's not taken now. Will my stop take as well? Like to me. Adjusting my stop stop to this low. I gave it one handle for spray now. I think this might hit the stop, but it's okay. If it gets me back up, I'm gonna make a close trade. Get it back up to around break even, ideally, maybe plus five. I just close that as a second trade. It was like eighty dollars. Um, I'm waiting for more confirmation. I like it now to see it keep running higher, but like I said, um, if it can come back down into this candle here, yeah, I'm gonna start with one. Oop. And as a late entry again. Start with one first, try a little bit lower into it. Okay. Yeah, it's like we're exactly the same where we're at. Um, but yeah, my stop's gonna be underneath this low here. Okay. Okay. And then I will be looking for, like I said, 
Um, these sides to get cleared first, ideally. Trade it, trade it way back into it. I'm probably looking for this here to be my take profit for now. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna close in half here. And then last one would be ideally to try to get up to these highs here. Okay. Let's see, let's see how it runs because like I said, I don't want to see this low get take now. Like it looks like it wants to run for those lows here. So gotta be very, very careful. Like there are still lows here to be taken. Um I want to see them run out these highs, ideally. Yeah, ideally, I want to see one of I'm actually just going to pick this out and close both here and get out up here. We will see. We shall see. This is a nice low. I don't want them to get taken out. But... Okay. Running back up now, which is nice, nice. Yeah, I just want to see it get up onto these highs here. <laughs> Let's go to 30 seconds, see how it's working out. Okay. Hey, I want to see him take out this high here. Five, five, two. Work its way for these highs is ideal. I want to see it. Mm. I want to see it start moving. Like, really, really start moving. If it doesn't start moving, I might have to close this trade. So we got. I'll give them like two minutes, like three o'clock, three p.m. New York time. I want to see this start running. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this. It's slow. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I don't I don't like this. Hmm. Yeah, we see a nice Trying to clear these lows out. I see that. Takes out these lows here. I want to see it move above these this inefficiency right here. I do not want to see it go lower. I'm gonna hover my clothes though. I don't want to hop into a short um, either, even though it looks like they want to run for these lows. Um, I'd rather just close my position, if anything. I'll get stopped. Yeah, there's a stop. Okay, it's okay. It looks like they're running for these lows now. So that was like a minus 600, which is okay. Nothing too crazy. Now I'm just going to wait. I'm still hunting the draw, but I want to uh, wait for a little bit. Definitely looks like it wants to run for these lows now. So I have to wait for uh, sponsorship, if anything. This, this run lower is nice. Like it's responding off it now, which is ideal. Just checking to see which 
as I want to do now. Hmm. Hmm. Looks like it wants to run higher now. Okay, that's good. Let me see a retracement lower. Okay. I am in again another long position. Right. Uh, idea is the same. Leave my stop underneath this low here. Give it like a one handle. All right. And then, like I said, looking for these highs up here. That's the target. Okay. Let's observe it. Um, yeah, I want to see run into these highs here. Run up and above these highs here. I want to use this as a stop run. It looks extremely solid now. Nice. Um, beautiful run. Um, I'm close one right there. Changes to one. Just want some partial value, you know. Okay. Yeah. As soon as it gets up there. Oh, there you go. Beautiful. All right. So, to fix a little boo boo. Made another like two hundred. I mean, that's more than enough. It should be running for these highs next. Um, so as you guys can see, these stops happen, right? Uh, I wasn't really anticipating another stop run, but it did do that. Uh, the reason why I didn't want to see these low get taken out was it cleared the bodies of it very nicely. So I wasn't really anticipating another stop run lower. Um, so when price started moving higher, trapped lower, I thought this would be the manipulation move where I was then comfortable, obviously longing it. But stop me out because my stop was a little tight. And to be fair, learn my lesson there next time. I'll probably just slap it behind below these lows. Um, but it's okay. Has to create another stop run, run higher, retrace. As you can see, that's my entry. I can show you guys my executions. Right. So bought the stop run, right? Um, closed it out when I was like, okay, break even. Bought it again because I was like, okay, this might be enough, but stop me out. Bought this uh, run lower again, runs higher, partial out here, and final TP out there. I'm going to run, run about, uh, run up higher. Um, but yeah, that should be it. Hope you guys enjoyed. All right, the account is at $1,400. Yeah, I think I'm going to actually just call it a day here. No, no real rush to do it. So 1406 would be the end of the day balance. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Obviously, episode two, right? Live trading, showing a little, little bit of um, what happens in day-to-day -day trading, just be able to adapt and uh, whatnot. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, take care, good luck and good trading, you guys.